What's your opinion on the issue between Kosovo and Ser Serbia, where Serbia complains that Kosovo has put uh, put a 100% import tax on Serbian products while, while they decline to recognize the independence of Kosovo and try to block their um, accession to international organizations. Uh, Jilly, I'll give you my opinion. Uh, I'm not, I haven't looked into the intricate uh, details, all the stuff. I know some of the things that took place, but I haven't like looked focused in on that zone specifically but that is part of a grander picture of the war that's going on and the boundaries that are trying to be be drawn right now let me get caught up with chat and remind me again i'll mention a little bit more uh, regarding that uh if possible but uh, basically it's part of a grander picture uh what's going on here I might as well address it now what's going on in my opinion what's going on in all these proxies right proxy locations around the globe between Serbia, Kosovo, and all this jazz. All that stuff is going on as part of a grander design of the powers, two main powers, and you got Asia going on as well with China. But right now, mainly, you could, you could say it's Russia and the West, Europe, and the United States. A lot of it being driven from the United States, from the neocon, from the neoconservatives from the United States everywhere right now where they could flare up conflict they're flaring up conflict and the way they're flaring up these conflicts is seeds that they have planted years ago or decades ago because as human beings they tell us we should have a five-year plan right you should you should have a lifetime plan 20-year plan 10-year plan and so on and so forth you should be able to We've mentioned this before do a calculus extrapolate your vision of where you can be or where you want to be or where you don't want to be for an extended period of time just imagine we do this as human beings how far do you think corporations and governments look down a while right one of the examples is the invasion of panama in the late 1990s early 19 uh late 1980s early 1990s they they said they went after noriega because he was a drug dealer they didn't go after Noriega because he was a drug dealer, because he was CIA's drug dealer. They went after Noriega because in 1999, I might have my dates wrong a little bit, because in 1999, the Panama Canal was supposed to be handed over to the Panamanian people. And there's absolutely no way that the United States would have allowed the Panama Canal to be handed over to the Panamanians. So they went in there and still retained control over the Panama Canal, which is also one of the reasons that China a few years ago announced that they're going to be building they're proposing and investing money in into building a canal i don't know if it's through panama or whatnot but building a canal in central america that will be parallel basically to get ships from one side to the other side so it's a grand scheme the question is where do you lie in that grand scheme whose interests are being served any place that there's going to be a flare-up where the interests of that flare-up are outside parties the most of the benefits are going to be reaped by the outside parties do not participate in stay localized ask ask yourself what is what is in the best interest of the people living here okay everybody living here not this group of people living here and you want the other group of people out right so don't take sides within your region geographic region right what everybody has to ask themselves is what is in the best interest of the people living here inclusive of everybody living here right there is no other in your region where you live okay everybody you're all equal right what's in the best interest of the people living there is it going to be dialogue or is it going to be uh, war at least for a recorded history we've tended to name ages after primary weapon used stone age bronze age iron age and as recent as the atomic age well it's no mistake that this is the information age yeah so very well put 